Gege Akutami, the creator of Jujutsu Kaisen, is a master of foreshadowing, and this is a perfect example of why. Manga spoilers ahead. In the cover page of the very first chapter, we see Yuji, Nobara, Megumi, and Gojo with this weird looking mummy thing kind of in the background of everything. Well, over 200 chapters later, we actually see this mummy again. When it's revealed that Kenjaku has known the location of Sukuna's mummified corpse this entire time, which indeed is the mummy that we see on the cover page of the first chapter. On top of that, in a huge twist in the manga, Sukuna ends up taking over Megumi's body, which again was also foreshadowed in the cover page of the first chapter, because if you look closely, some of the toads that Megumi has summoned from his 10 shadows technique have extremely similar markings to that of Sukuna's. I mean, come on, this level of foreshadowing is unreal, right? 